It scares you. But once you've tasted it, you can't stop. That's all you think about. Like I said, it consumes you. Every second of every day for the last two fucking years, I kept myself in check. Gritted my teeth and kept it buried. Oh, now it's back. And I can feel what it's doing to me. So, uh, I guess setting you up with the twins didn't go so good, huh? <laughs> yeah, no shit. I'm glad you're all right, Vin. Now, can you tell me what the fuck just happened? I don't know. I saw some weird-looking guy had a limp. It was crazy. Like, one minute he's there, the next minute the guy just fucking disappears. I don't know. I must have hit my head or something. Look, anyways, Jimmy says he's got a lead on the crew that hit us. Good. I'll find Jimmy. Tell him to meet me in my office. I'm gonna head upstairs. Yeah, sure. Whatever you need, Jackie. Go to Jackie's bedroom upstairs, but look at everything. Hey, we got a fancy-ass oh, area. Yeah. Don't grunt at me. I gotta look around. We got fucking, like, suits of armor and shit? Damn! Jackie's living your life! You'll never get it. On the water, on my boat, I can just kick back. I ain't getting any younger. About time I take it easy, you know? It's a fucking boat, Frank. Can a boat tuck you in at night? Can a boat make you children? A boat has an anchor that I control. Not the other way around, Eddie. You calling my wife an anchor? She's my sister. I call her whatever I want. <laughs> You're a fucking mess. Jackie, how you doing? I'm pissed off, boys. We're gonna find these fucks. Jimmy's got some info already. How the fuck's that guy know everything? He's a goddamn encyclopedia. Encyclopedia? Listen to you. Like you ever cracked a book in your life. <laughs> this fucking guy, right? If he wasn't already married to my sister, I'd have to punish him by introducing him all over again. <laughs> talk shit, but I know we're gonna see you for dinner on Sunday. Hey, Jackie, you say the word, and we're ready to go. We got your back, boss. Thanks a lot, boys. And drink up. It's gonna be a long night. Yeah, I think I can handle everything on my own, though. I mean, because I don't want you guys to die. I've got my crew. Asshat, is you ain't never been in love. I love my boat. That don't count. Oh, are they repeating the conversation? Drinking. No, no, no. Real love with a person. Like I said, in love. Oh, and you have. Yeah, I've been in love. I'm in love right now. With my wife. <laughs> with my mistress. Whoa. Hell, I even loved that whole Camille from the other night. Whoa. <laughs> yeah, right? <laughs> <laughs> okay, all right. Now you're talking about, like, cheating and then, and, and, well, I don't know. Polygamy is a thing. Seem right. I think the guy's fucking nuts. You think the boss is a nut job? What, you don't? Excuse me? What did you say? Oh, hey, Jackie. Looking good, boss. Jackie, uh, let us know what you need, okay? <laughs> Shit, boss hurts call him crazy. Damn. Kiss ass. Shut up, cheese dick. Wait, who are you? Mr. Higgins. Sir, uh, perhaps you could have a word with Master Dolfo. The neighbors have been complaining again. Who'd do such a thing, I wonder? I'm so glad you're still alive, sir. Okay. You know, I should probably go upstairs. I know where I need to go. It's just, we're doing the whole hub world thing. Well, not really hub world. I just want to talk around with the crew and stuff like that. I know what I need to do. Gabe, don't talk to me. Jackie. Tony, I heard you like strawberries. Uh, I can't talk to him. <laughs> it gave me the option for like a second, but now I can't. Okay. Let's move back and Jackie, come back. Don't take this the wrong way, but I got a sausage over here with your name on it. See, I knew you'd take it the wrong way. I like sausages. Sausages are fucking tasty. Throw some bacon on that, though. Bacon and sausages. Freezer on the- oh. Go with God. No, I don't think I should go with God. I mean, considering things, uh, pretty, pretty much got Satan on my back. I mean, it's just called the darkness, but I like to call him the devil or Satan or whatever. <laughs> the not God. Hey, how's it going? Gotta fucking run the goddamn water bill. I'm the Dawn. I can do what I want. Thank Christ, he got it back. You know. What do you mean? 
You heard the expression, mess with the bull and you get the horns? <laughs> well, mess with Jackie and you get those two things of his. I'll take those things over horns any day. I mean, how do you think he took over the whole family so fast in the first place? That fucking thing of his, that's how. <laughs> well, I'm glad you acknowledged that, Butcher. Hey, buddy, hey, how's it going? Butch, Leo. Hey, boss. We was just talking about you. Glad you got your, uh, mojo back. Let's send a message to these fucks that think they can hit us. Hey, you got that right. We're ready whenever you need us, boss. I'm glad my crew is so fucking, like, accepting of the darkness. It's like, hey, yeah, I'm glad we got that he thing on our side. He ain't been the same since he lost Jenny. Of course he's different now. If someone blew your girlfriend's face off in front of you, you wouldn't be fought in sunshine either. Shit, no. But Jackie's tough. Nothing he can't handle, right? Yeah, well, sure as hell hope so. I miss Jenny. It'd be great if I could just bring Jenny into this kind of, uh, kind of environment. I mean, look at this. This place is awesome! Light a candle for Jenny? Oh. Hey, Jenster. You kind of got me hit by a train, but, you know, you know I, I'm just going to assume that was, uh, just some I saw traumatic you memories. Today. In the alley. Down on the tracks. I still see you. Everywhere I go. You torture yourself with her memory, Jackie. Sarah? Hey! Jenny would never have wanted this. It scares me that you're so much like your father, Carlo. He could never let things go. And Sarah, I'm fine. How many times I gotta tell you? You're a terrible liar, Jackie. Sometimes... Sometimes I, I think I see her. And it's like... It's like she's not gone. But she is gone, Jackie. You buried Jenny years ago. I know, I know. Listen, Aunt Sarah, thanks for looking out for me. But I'm okay, all right? Just got a lot on my mind right now is all. Fine. You ever get the balls to actually talk about all this? Come see me in my room. <laughs> let's discuss it some more. All right, fine. You want to bust my chops, then let's talk. What do you mean, like my father? I loved your father. Everyone loved Carlo. He just had that way about him. But before... Before we lost him, he couldn't let things go. He became obsessed, and that obsession consumed him, Jackie. I don't want to see the same thing happen to you. Obsessed with what? It, it's not important. Y you just have to let go, Jackie. You have to move on with your life. I am, Aunt Sarah. I am. You really are the worst liar I've ever met. And I grew up with thieves. So what then? I'm seeing ghosts? I don't believe in ghosts, Jackie. But I do believe in being haunted. You need to man up and let all of this go. You're right. How come you're always right? Comes with age, kiddo. I'll talk to you later, Aunt Sarah. You know where to find me. Actually, I don't, but I'm gonna assume that you're in the other room over there. I mean... I don't think we're obsessed over Jackie, it's just, you know, I like can... Love of his life, together for a very long time, got her head blown out right in front of us. Lighting a candle for her and sometimes seeing her image isn't too bad of a thing. Not in the... I wouldn't want a bed that's right in the middle of a room. I'm, I'm just saying. If this were my room, I'd fill it up with a lot of things. There's way too much empty space, Jackie! Ah, oh, well. At least I don't have my fucking trench coat thing anymore. At least it's not as long. Let's get my hot tub Ronan. Actually, what am I doing now? Am I sleeping? Am I saying goodbye to Jenny? Or am I gonna go be talking to Sarah? Hmm. Although I think it's kind of amusing that they're kind of bringing up... Uh, Jackie's father now. Like, you didn't really hear any kind of mention of Jackie's father. It's just like, oh! He was taken from the... the orphanage from... by Polly. And then, now it's like, oh, but remember his father? Yeah, it's gonna be talking about, like, the darkness hey, and shit like that. So what's what? I want you to go find somebody for me. Johnny Powell. Lives down by the Queensboro Bridge. 
You find him and bring him back here. Johnny Powell? Ain't that the guy that used to help you out with that thing of yours? He was a weird fuck. Whatever happened to that guy anyway? It don't matter. I need him back. Go bring him by for a visit. And hey, you don't have to be nice to him. Whatever you say, boss. I'll have the new guys go get him. Oh, hey, uh, Jimmy's waiting for you in your office. He's got a lead on the guys who hit us tonight. Thanks, Vinny. Anytime, boss. Let me know if you need anything else. Okay, Vinny. I'll go downstairs real soon, but first, I'm gonna investigate the top area because <laughs> we investigated a, good amount, investigated a good amount of the area downstairs, but that was about it. Oh, just all the rooms, super fancy. God! Maybe being a criminal is- no, 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 I mean, uh... Hey, Jackie, what's what? Nothing, I'm just admiring the fact that we've been amassed such a good wealth. Hey, Sarah! I can't talk to her. Damn, alright. Ooh, what is this? Relic, the true revelation! God, that's a lot of fucking essence. 300? I need to find more of those. Not even just like... What a fucking mess, right, Jackie? Yeah, see, I like collectibles that reward me a lot more. I don't care about, like, supremely, like, Oh, you can you can call and it'll make a funny message. No! Give me essence points so I can, uh, increase my skills. Shit like that. Yo, Jackie. Jimmy. Good to see you in one piece, kid. And Vinny says you got information for me. This thing at the restaurant. I just heard from Emilio Capizzi. A couple of hours later, someone torched our warehouse down at the docks, and Freddy tells me two of our boys got clipped outside of Gino's deli tonight. Somebody's making a play. Whoever did this to us is dead. You hear me, Jimmy? There's the Jackie Estacado I know. Vinny told me you got that thing of yours back tonight. It's about fucking time. All right, all right. Just tell me what you know already. A waiter recognized one of the guys who came into the restaurant tonight. Some guy named Swifty. Oh, Swifty. Yeah, I know that prick. He left as soon as I got there. Yeah, I never actually met him before, but I'm definitely looking forward to meeting him now. I had Vinny get some of the boys together. Let us know when you're ready to go and kick some righteous ass. Sure, all right. Leave the mansion with Vinny? Oh, wait. Wait. Checking out there. All right, let's go. I think we're all do- uh, fine. Oh, look. They're covering the story. I'm going, I'm going, I'm going. Jackie, give me a shot when you're ready to go. Uh... I think that's about all we can do in here. Okay, so Lone Ranger gets... Besides listening to conversations. Assholes, right? Indians. No, bad guys, thieves, assholes, come on. Criminals. Sure, okay, so, Lone Ranger gets captured by a bunch of fucking criminals. When those bad guys' backs are turned, Lone Ranger sees, up on the hill across the valley, his best buddy, Tano. Yeah, the Indian. No, the Native American. <laughs> all right, all right, Native American. Okay, so the Lone Ranger can't escape. He's surrounded by all these assholes, right? But when nobody's looking, he snags a blanket and gets his ass over to the campfire. Where did he get a blanket? Hey, what do you fucking care? I bet it was a saddle blanket. Fine, genius. A saddle blanket. Okay, Lone Ranger grabs a fucking saddle blanket and starts fanning over the fire. He's sending smoke signals to the Yankee. The Native American, right? Fucking A right. He's sending a smoke signal. Tano sees the signal, nods, and tears his ass out of there. Now, when Tano comes back, he's got this beautiful blonde with big ass titties with him, right? <laughs> yeah? Lone Ranger sees the blonde and shakes his head, no. So the Lone Ranger fans the fire, sending Tano to smoke signal again. Tano sees it, nods, then races off. This time, he comes back with a hot, long-legged brunette bitch, right? <laughs> right. Lone Ranger sees this chick, shakes his head again, no. Fans the flame, sends the same smoke signal a third time, off Tano goes, this time, he brings back a smoking redhead, right? Lone Ranger finally drops the blanket, just yells across the valley at the top of his fucking lungs. I said, posse, you <laughs> asshole! <laughs> <laughs> uh, shit. Right? <laughs> hey, boss. Hey. Hey, Jackie. I like that story. So? Things are good? It's a nice day. Oh, I thought I was gonna- I thought we were about to engage in a conversation. Like, hey, man. 
We're heading out to get uh, one of the guys who hit us. Things like that. Exactly. Come on, Vinny. What say we go pay this asshole Swifty a visit? Let's go. Let's go crack some skulls. Out of boy, boss. Let's head down. Ah, I'm just ready to continue on and shoot some people, eat well, their hearts. Here we go. Yeah. Time to go to work. Want to know something funny? When I was a kid, the dark used to scare the shit right out of me. I always felt like there was something out there. In the shadows. Just waiting. And Sarah always said I was a smart kid. She tried to tell me, Jackie, either you control your fears, or they'll control you. And I tried to control them, believe me. I tried. But every night, there I was. Hiding under the sheets, trying to convince myself that whatever was out there wasn't real. Thank God I outgrew that shit, huh? Yeah, when we were a kid. Even though I'm pretty sure we were taken out of the orphanage. Ah, I don't know what time, what age he was when he got taken out of the orphanage. Ah, well. Hey, Jackie's here. Yo, Jackie. You wanna give me a hand here? Dag says I'm not supposed to lift anything heavy. Yeah, well then you should have no problem there, pal. <laughs> okay, well what? Hey, what do you want me to do? Ready to do your thing? No, I don't know what I'm doing. He asked me a question like, "Can yeah, do everything?" Unless you're talking about your dick, then never mind. I'm good. I don't want to lift anything. Just point me in the right direction, Jimmy. Swifty was at the restaurant just before it all went down. He runs an executive poker game in a pool hall up around this corner. Follow me. This is Swifty's neighborhood, Jackie. We don't got a lot of friends around here. And those guys in there with Swifty? They ain't exactly the friendly types either. Eh, I don't mind. We'll just shoot Good. them all. Cause I ain't exactly in a friendly mood. Tell Vinny and the boys to seal off the exits. Nobody leaves here alive until I get some answers. That a boy, Jackie. Jackie, here he is. Oh, hey, hiya, Jackie. Those are some nice shoes. Are those Balooties? Oh, wait. Stop kissing my ass. <laughs> Kisses. Oh, yeah. Great, we got our bridge guy back. Ugh. Do you always have to be around? Alright, what do we got available? We got a thousand points, so let's see what we can get. I need to do this. Oh, shit, that was actually an accident. Reset? Oh, I don't want to fucking reset all my talents. Well... Oops! <laughs> ah well, it was what I was looking at anyways. Hey guys! Stop talking and show me what you can do. Oh, you're still alive! That explains so much. Uh, too bad I don't have a gun. But who needs a gun? I have. Bull sticks! <laughs> hey, I heard you guys like beer! Oh, I lost it. That's okay. I guess I can have a gun. Whoa, buddy! Here, yeah, give me my health back. Yeah, oh, can I grab this back? Uh oh. Do wielding time, motherfucker! Yeah! So I guess I don't get to do like the super dramatic executions with my own guns. It's all just flashing the shit out of them. Ah, what do you think I'm doing? Did I kill my Darkling? I did. Oops. <laughs> I'm just trying to break the lights, yo. Ah, we're going upstairs. What are we gonna do? Point around and if you've got any space and You'll realize soon that that won't help you, Swifty! <laughs> Oh man, he fucking closed the door behind him. Whatever will I do? 
hearts. Oh, can you give me two hearts? Oh, yeah. I definitely don't mind the fact that I, uh, accidentally got the execution increase. Two hearts? Well, unless we can increase our hearts, or how many heart, uh, health bars we have, then yeah, it, it's a pretty good buy. Half our health in one go? Okay, I mean, <laughs> I could just shoot all of them. Like this. Uh-oh. Have a pallet. Nope, that didn't work. Dual Uzi time, buddy. Oh, more assets, apparently. I can't believe I got 600 assets in that time. Well, yeah, holy shit. Oh yeah, I got a relic, that's why. Uh, I don't care about that. Press right... Mouse immediately after firing a shotgun for a rapid pump action that lessens the spread of the next shot. Hmm. Press after to release a swarm. Gun channeling. Demonic lift. Oh! Black hole attack? I would like that. Uh, well. Swarm sounds kind of scary. Press that to release a swarm, then you can do, uh, increase the stun time, allow swarms to reach more targets, shit like that. Well, let's try gun channeling. That sounds badass. 